Okay. <laughs> Let's just see what else we can find. Tingle, what do you have? Gaia Master Duel. Card attackers. Uh, well then. Oh, hey, Capcom. Alright, I was expecting some random one-off company for this sort of thing, but, um, sure. Okay, so we have floating island thing, and that's all we get told. <laughs> okay, story mode, so this is a deck edit. Skill edit, interesting. Card shop. And option mode. So let's just dive right into the story. So since we have, um... Interesting. I'm left wondering if this is based on an anime or not. Let's go with purple-haired guy. And we have Sample Deck 1. Awesome. I'm sure this will be amazing. It's the most powerful deck ever. And we can scroll through the text amazingly fast. Um, board game. Was not expecting board game. So it's a board card game. Don't really see too many of those. I think I just claimed that spot for myself, although I'm not really certain. And he's building a thing there. Is this like that, um... Fortune Street type game where you claim spots and build buildings? This is... different. Having an actual understanding of the rules would indeed be a nice thing to start off with, but um... Okay, we dice cards... purchase. We purchase, I wonder. Hmm. Interesting. Sure, let's build a bank. We landed on a special thing, and we get a card! Sort of card. Okay, I think that means we roll three dice. We'll find out in a second. Definitely feeling a lot like Fortune Street, except a little bit more advanced. Well then, this is different. So he wants to take over my spot, and to do so, we card battle. Sword. Let's go with the sword. Oh, jeez. Arrows are kicking my ass. Something better than the sword here for round two. Ah, uh, arrows of 54. Yeah, take that. Ow. Haha! <laughs> awesome. Try the ring, see what that does. Oh, um, round denied, I don't know. Oh, we're winning at least. And 
this sword can be gone? Uh, we lost. What? But we were ahead in terms of hit points. But what? Hmm. So, I don't quite know why or how or what. Oh, then we got two spots. I really wish I had a manual here, because, wow, this looks like it could be really interesting and really awesome if you had even the first idea of just what the hell was going on. that. Wow, we have a lot of cards. Okay, was not really expecting that, so battle cards, one extra dice, let's try the four dice. See if that is in fact... Oh, I see. It's not roll four dice, it's move ahead four. And we had to pay for landing on his spot. What's going on? I really, really wish I did. Okay, we restored 30 hit points. Ow. Holy crap, wow. So apparently he got a lot of good cards in the meantime. Try this, see what it does. It looks like it's gonna be restoring HP. So, yeah, that's a very good thing. And I would not imagine that these characters are from Seiken Densetsu, given that this is a Capcom game. And, you know, Seiken Densetsu is entirely square. Square was not mentioned anywhere in that initial thing. Okay, so, um, yeah. Don't even know if we're gonna make it to the end of this, uh... round? Or, well, not round, but, you know, this... game, I guess? Okay, so that is for selling, then. So again, it would be really nice. Hospital and church. Bank. Possibly armor and item and... Hmm. Let's just go with that one and see what we get. somewhere, so... Maybe we can actually just defeat them 
by way of, you know, taking out all of their HP. Okay, so... I win based on, uh, <laughs> the fact that they have no HP left. And, um... Okay, we're still playing the board game. And hey, we landed on a thing. What's the thing? Sounds dire. I guess it wasn't. money gained on landing on Go, but we did get a couple nice cards. And if I had any better idea of how to actually play this, I would be, you know, building a lot more buildings. I don't really know how to strategize, I'm just doing random things. Again, this looks like it would be really awesomely fun if you had even the slightest clue of, you know, what you're meant to do in this. I mean, I came in expecting a kind of a crappy card game, you know, like, given the popularity of Magic and Yu-Gi-Oh! and Dual Masters and all that around this time, I was expecting just some crappy card game knockoff, trying to cash in on the big popular thing at the time. But this absolutely is not. This is very much its own thing, and it just seems really cool. As it is, though, like, again, I have no idea what the end goal is going to be. I don't know if I'm trying to bankrupt him, or... ...try and get all the spots on the board for myself, or... ...trying to amass a certain amount of wealth myself, or... ...what the deal is here. I think that's going to be about it for this, um, let's just check the data, why not? No, we are actually losing pretty miserably, but, um, yeah. yeah this has been, uh, Gaia Master Duel Card Attackers. Seems really awesome, if you have even the slightest clue of what you're doing, but, um, if can't really say too much else on it, since we don't speak the language. And, yeah, I guess we're done here. Not really much else to say.